Hey guys, my name is Tyler. Welcome back to Racket Champion. And today we have a review of the Yonex Power Cushion 03Z. So these shoes were released in 2017. It is the successor to the Power Cushion 03 and it is used properly by professionals such as Lee Chang Wei from Malaysia and Lee Young Day from Korea. It comes in many different colorways such as the ones I have here, black, blue, and orange, as well as a solar red, a yellow one for the ladies, and a brand new white one with each one coming with the hexagon futuristic design. The shoe gets its name from its power cushion technology, which comes in every Yonex shoe, which allows the player to have more aggressive footwork and absorbs more shock. Getting into the materials of this shoe, the upper of it is comprised of leather, polyester mesh, and durable skin. The midsole has the most materials, consisting of tough brid light, power graphite sheath, TPU, power cushion, solid EVA, and the outsole is just rubber. In terms of technology, the first one is a synchro fit insole, which creates a secure contact between the foot and the shoe. The second one is toe assist shape, which is a toe centric design, which cuts down the pressure on the big toe and offers more support at the midfoot and the heel. The next one is the hexagrip, which is the outsole, which offers 3% more grip and is 20% lighter than standard sole materials. Finally, you'll notice there's no tongue on the shoe, so you just slip in your foot like a sock. Now, getting into my personal opinion of this shoe, I have to say the design of the shoe is really cool, especially the Lee Chong Wei version. The materials Yonex used in the power cushion are really good quality as well, and it is by far the most comfortable shoe I've ever played with. I'd say they're more comfortable than the Aris 2s. However, one thing I've noticed is that there is not much ankle support with this shoe, because the ankle area stretched out like a sock, so I find myself losing my balance every so often. Granted, I did get a size too big in this shoe, so I solved the problem by getting a, an insole, but I think if even if I got my true to size and I didn't have to put the insole in, I would have still had the same problem with the ankle area. Overall, I still think this shoe is a really good shoe. I know I'm gonna be using it all the time, and I recommend it to anyone playing at the clubs or during practice, not so much at tournaments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know your opinion on this review, as well if you've tried out this shoe, the Power Cushion 03Z, in the comments down below. We'll see you guys next time.